Hi, this is Jason with Dave's Computer Tips with another how-to video for you. This one's on how to adjust playback settings on your YouTube account. That's right, the videos you see, you know, captions come on or don't come on, or the quality of it, um, high definition or standard definition. I'm going to show you where the settings are on your YouTube account on how to adjust those um, to the settings you desire. I have done uh, YouTube videos before. I think the last one's been a while. It was on how to switch between YouTube accounts. I'll put the link down below so you can actually check it out. But I wanted to get back onto YouTube and give you some more tips. So we're going to do that this time on, on how to adjust playback settings on your YouTube account. Um, before we get going, hit the like on this video. It really helps out our channel. Also hit the subscribe and the notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. We come out with every Thursday. So every Thursday, make sure you always check back and make sure you have the notifications on. Okay. Let's get started. I will show you this on the YouTube website. Um, I'm not going to be showing on the app, so this is going to be through the YouTube website. So we're going to do that right here. So first thing you want to do is go to your YouTube. And you want to make sure you're signed in to your YouTube account, which you know how to do. You go up to the little profile there, you click on it, and you sign in um, if you're not signed in already. But if you're already signed in, you want to look to the top right like we did, and you click on your profile link. And you're going to go down to... The settings right here you're going to click on settings and then what you're going to do is you're going to look to the left menu and you're going to look for playback and performance very straightforward and that's your playback settings so they give you a couple options in here so this um, control your video viewing experience playback settings apply to the browser only so this will apply to this browser you're on so whatever browser you're on that you're going to have, if you're on a different browser when you use it, you're going to have to change it on that browser. But this browser on my computer, I'm doing the settings on there. So it only affects this browser. Just FYI. All right. So what you want to do, you can look down here. Info card, I'm not going to really get into, um, but like here, subtitles and closed caption. That's kind of important. You can have always show captions or you include auto generated captions when available. So you can check both those boxes. See, it says, your changes have been saved. It automatically saves them. So FYI on that, on these ones. I'm not going to have that. I always show my captions. I don't know if you want that or not, but I like to have them on if they're available. So if we're going to go down to, here's the um, uh, video, audio video quality. So you have AV1 settings. So you have auto. I have it choose automatically between the two, but you can switch between these two. So streaming AV1 in standard definition will use AV1 up to 480p. So if you know your system... Um, and VP9 up to for higher re resolution formats, which is great. It just talking about how high the standard, you know, standard definition is going to run. You can choose this one. Then you have always prefer this. So you always want to check these things. So this is an HD, um, requires powerful computers. So if you want a really high resolution, like 1080p or higher, um, you, you got to make sure your computer can handle it. I usually leave it on auto so the system just, the YouTube just goes, oh, this is what it should be played at. And I leave it on that. So you can choose any one of those if you want. So let's say if we did like this. And it automatically updates. So I'm going to switch it back to recommended. And then you're going to scroll down. Mine, not all. I've noticed I try this on a different um, YouTube account. This doesn't always show your playback area. Um, it tells you where you're, you know, where you're located. I don't think that's important. I don't know why that's even there. I should probably clear, but I'm going to leave it there for now. So if you look down a little ways, you go browsing, uh, video previews. Video previews will play when you hover over thumbnails. That's on for me, but you can actually turn that off. And I'm going to turn it back on. I like it on. So, um, and then uh, that's it. Those are the controls in the, ba in the um, settings of your Google account on this browser. So it knows the, what you want the video viewing settings to be. Now, I want to give you an extra tip here. So I'm going to go back up here. Now I wrote an article on this. I'll have the link down below for you. But let's go into a video. Let's say you're on a video. You can mess with the settings here too. I mean, it doesn't change the default settings. But if you click on here, the little, little gear icon at the bottom of the video, you can go in here, you turn off subtitles, turn on subtitles. Um, I don't know what the sleep timer, my sleep timer is on, on. I'm not going to mess with that. But I wanted to show you there's a spot on the video you can mess with this. The speed. So if you want to slow down, speed up speed, that's kind of fun. So just a little bonus for you to check out if you wanted to come in here and mess with it. But the quality, there it is. That's the one I was I was thinking about. You can change the quality. So you can change the quality of your video. I have it auto, just like I said, I have a set it auto. 
And then you can always change, like 1080p I talked about, that's, that would mean your computer better be able to handle that. <laughs> just want to warn you, if it doesn't handle that, you're going to slow down your computer and you're going to have some lag. But yeah, so that's another place you can find some of the settings, but the main, main default setting stuff is right here under the privacy and performance area um, in your YouTube um, settings. So that's how you do it. That's how easy it is to do this. Um, make sure you go in there, check it out, share this with your friends, and uh, thanks for watching. Make sure to check out davescomputertips.com. That's where all our articles are. And also make sure you subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching.